I'm Sin of a Helgerud, and I'm one of those rare women who grew up on a farm and didn't learn how to cook. I was more interested in reading books than acquiring domestic skills. If you would like to learn along with me, tie on your aprons and let's give it a try. Let's make dumplings in fruit sauce. I made up this recipe years ago. When I googled dumplings and fruit sauce, somebody else had already taken the credit for it. Start with any kind of fruit sauce. Dig down into your deep freeze and pull out something good. Or open up a can. Or start with fresh berries. You know what to do. Raspberries and plums make a good flavor combination. Start the sauce simmering in a large kettle on top of your stove. Next, we'll make the dumplings. These are the same kind your grandma made when she cooked chicken and dumplings. I'll bet she never thought of combining her dumplings with fruit sauce. Or maybe she did. Sift together one and one half cups flour, two teaspoons baking powder, and a half teaspoon of salt. Cut in three tablespoons of butter. Stir in three-fourths cup of milk. Drop spoonfuls of the batter into the simmering sauce and cook for 10 minutes uncovered. Then cook tightly covered for another 10 minutes. Serve warm or cold with milk or cream. This is a good dessert to serve on a cold, rainy evening. Don't make the same mistake I did and try to simmer the sauce over direct heat. Use a double boiler or a barrier between the flame and the bottom of the kettle. I ended up scorching that kettle and throwing it out. That wouldn't surprise the neighbors. Everybody knows I can't cook.